Hi, Libra. Hi. How are you doing today, Libra? Hmm. And like I always say, Libra, if you're feeling alone right now, you are not, okay? You are not. Now, Libra, I still got some personal readings that is still available. All you have to do is add my Facebook page at Leo's Tarot. If you don't see that sunflower and that Leo and that lion, that is not me, Libra. All readings are $75 through Cash Amnesia Love for $75. And I now accept PayPal. All readings are raw and uncut. Get it now, Libra. Let's go. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe as well if this is your story. For the person that is headed towards my Libra, what is this person's true intentions and what do, what do they got planned for Libra? What do this person have planned for my beautiful Libra? Woo. Libra. You dealing with someone who ghosted you before? Okay, Libra, for the first card for your person, we have the hermit here. Libra, this is someone who ghosted you out of nowhere. Disappeared out of nowhere, didn't tell you anything. We're also going to clarify everything, Libra. This is someone who ghosted you out of nowhere, didn't tell you anything. Could be dealing with a Virgo, Capricorn, Sagittarius. Don't have to be. But this is someone also Aquarius at the bottom of the deck. This is someone who also kept their feelings hid from you. Also, for your person, Libra, we have the king of pentacles here. This is someone who was in their ego. They only cared about the things they wanted. And this person was also materialistic, too. Like, they'll feel like if someone have more material things than you, then they're better than you or they're somehow over you or something. Like, they seen value in the things that people had, not who the people are. I have to keep it real, Libra. For your person, we have the temperance card. So now this is showing me that this person want to reconcile with you. They want to reconcile with you after ghosting you, okay? And we have the page of the page of wands here. So it's showing me that this person have a lot of passion for you, Libra. A lot of passion for you, okay? They do, but I feel like it could be a little bit immature. I mean, it's cute, but it's like, ugh, grow up. I'm, I'm feeling that type of energy. For your person, Leo, we have the seven of pentacles. For some of you, you could be dealing with the Leo. Don't have to be. I don't know why I keep saying that. But we have the seven of pentacles here. It shows me that you have invested a lot of time in this person. And for them still, I feel, I just heard somebody say, for them still not to be opening up. <laughs> Libra. I feel like you're dealing with someone who just, they just won't open up. They just won't let you in. And it's getting on you, like it's, it's making you upset. I feel like it's making you upset. For your person, we have the Six of Cups. It is showing me that you have a lot of history with this person and they love that, that they do. I feel like they think they can get away with certain things with you because they know that you know that this is just how I am. For some reason, I feel like this person just make it seem like this is how they are and nothing's going to change. Okay? We have the Seven of Swords here. So it's showing me that this person is very deceptive. They lie to you, Libra, for no reason. I feel like this person just lies, okay, when they don't feel like talking. This is someone who would lie to you when they don't feel like talking just to hurry up and get you off the phone just to hurry up and get you out their face and i have to keep it really raw that's kind of heartless but this is what you're dealing with for your person we have the five of pentacles here this is the one who will make you feel left out in the cold like your feelings doesn't matter and um sagittarius i mean not sagittarius what you're dealing with the sagittarius you got to be it's here but Libra, I feel like this is someone who makes you feel left out in the cold. I feel like you, and it's so crazy, um, Libra, you're not even overly, overly emotional with this person. But some, for some reason, they make you feel like when you talk about your feelings, Libra, or how you feel about things, they make you feel left out in the cold. They make you feel like you're the only one feeling like this. Why can't you just meet me in the middle? They will not do it. This person is not fair, Libra, and you are. And this person, this person, no, for some reason, I don't know why I'm getting this, but they, you got history with this person. And for some reason, this person feel like Libra know me. Libra always going to be fair when it comes to me. But this person is not being fair when it comes to you. And I think you need to have a wake up call and understand that. Why is the hermit card here for the person Libra is dealing with? So this person definitely want to reconcile with you. So they will be reaching out soon because they want to start all over. Clarify the hermit card. Ho, ho. 
look at this. Clarifying the hermit card, Libra. We have the three of pentacles. Showing me that this person ghosted you for a third party. Okay? They ghosted you for someone else, Libra. Clear, um, at the bottom of the deck, we have the hierophant here. It shows me that they see a commitment with this person they ghosted you for. They have genuine feelings and emotions for this person they ghosted you for. Okay? Yeah, this person, I don't like this person. I want to be honest. Why is the king of pentacles here for Libra's person? Care, clarifying, you got to be dealing with the Capricorn. Um, okay, for some of you. Clarifying the king of pentacles, we have the devil card. This person worships material things. This person is obsessed with getting more money, more money, more things, more things. They're obsessed with it. Even to the point where it's hard on them, but they still try to keep up this facade. Like, I got this, I got this. This person also want other people to worship them for the things they have. And I feel like, Libra, you're just not that person. You really don't care about what this person have. You just care about them wholeheartedly. You do, Libra. And I feel like they just don't get it. They don't understand why someone would like them just for them. Like, either you like me for the stuff I have or what I can get or what's wrong with you this is how this person is looking at you is weird like this person genuinely don't understand why you love them for them like why what is wrong with you you see what I'm saying like nothing is wrong with me this is how someone's supposed to care about you <laughs> why is the temperance card here for Libra's person yeah, clarify the temperance card. We have the four of wands. So it's going to show me, it's going to tell, it's telling me basically they're going to come back in your life and they want stability with you now. At least this is what they're, the face that they're going to put on, okay? They want stability with you now. They really want to settle down with you. They want commitment, okay? They want this, um, they want stability with you. They want to be stable with you, Libra. But I do feel like this person still got their eyes on other people and they're still very slow to commit. But they're coming in. Why is the page of wands here for Libra's person? Clarifying the page of wands, we have the nine of cups. So this is showing me, Libra, basically this person is immature, but they know that you're the person for them. You're, you're someone that they wished and prayed and always hoped that they would end up with. And now they have you and they're being very immature about it. And they also is giving you a hard time to be able to move forward and this connection to the point that you're questioning your judgment and why do you really stick around i don't know libra why why do you stick around to this hmm ask yourself that libra why is the seven of pentacles here for libra's person clarifying the seven of pentacles we have the wheel of fortune here so i feel like something is going to change or shift with this person but i'm gonna be honest with you it's not that good i feel like they're gonna get karma for what they did to you why it's because this person felt a very strong connection with you could be dealing with the gemini libra don't have to be this person felt a very strong connection with you from the very beginning although they made you feel like you were trapped in your mind and crazy and you was the only one loving them okay Okay, but really both of you guys seen love in each other, Libra. Okay, but this person was playing mind games. This person was playing mind games and made you feel like you was the only one that genuinely, sincerely cared. But they loved you. They just didn't know how to love you. I'm going to be honest. Why is the Six of Cups here for uh, Libra's person? Clarifying the Six of Cups, we have the Hierophant here. So it's showing me that now this person wants stability with you. This person even sees themselves marrying you, okay? And I do see them see what they're going to propose to you because they now know that you are the right person for them, Libra. And they want stability. You guys have so much history together. But I feel like the whole history y'all have together is this person being cold and detached from you. I mean, it's not good history. I mean, but it's history. This is how they looking at it, okay? Why well, is the Seven of Swords here for Libra's person? Clarifying the Seven of Swords is the Two of Pentacles. So Spirit is telling me that this person is still going to be juggling, telling the truth and lying to you, Libra. So please take that into consideration. Spirit is telling you to put your foot down, stand in your truth, and let this person know that you will not speak to them or deal with them unless they be honest with you and be truthful, Okay? Which I feel like you would have no problem in doing, Libra. Why is the Five of Pentacles here for Libra's person? Clarify the Five of Pentacles, Libra. We have the hangman here. Spirit is saying, really pause on giving this person a second chance until you know they're um know they're ready, okay? Because this person can end up leaving you out in the cold and things can end up ended again, the death card, okay? So really just think about um things and take it slow and make sure you see right through this person because they is a liar. 
here. I feel like this person juggles the truth and the lies, okay? So please be careful and make sure you just think twice, even three times, before you give this person a second chance with you because you deserve that. I love you so much, Libra. You are truly, truly loved by me. Bye, Libra.